Welcome to our final round of the Ski Barton competition. Super stoked for this round. This round we're going to do an après ski inspired cocktail using Dos Primos Blanco de Kiva. Après cocktail is probably the best part of the day. Everyone loves it. You get to unwind at the base with your homies, regroup with everybody, and talk about the gnarly lines and stories you had from that day. Whether you're a local, chilling at your local tavern, talking to your favorite bartender, or if you're out of towner at the hottest spot at the base of the mountain, having a nice drink around the fire with some strangers in your group, this is a good time to unwind. Tons of famous outright ski cocktails out there. You know, you got your apple spritz, you got your margaritas. They're all tasty, they all hit the spot. But this winter, we want to bring something new to you. Something that hasn't been really acknowledged too much, and it's going to be the next hottest cocktail. This is going to be a shout out to the East Coast boys, and the urban boys out there hitting stuff and coming out and ripping on the mountain. We're going to do a spin off the uh, New York Sour. Classic yet modern cocktail that's really overlooked and you don't see on a gun. We're going to be making the urban label today. It's the perfect thing to unwind with. So we're going to be bringing you two ounces of Dos Primos tequila in this. With a half ounce of Rothman and Winter cream to violet liqueur. Following that with two ounce or an ounce of fresh squeezed lemon juice and then a half ounce of a homemade ginger and lemon zest simple syrup. Crack an egg, put that whole egg, the egg white in there, and then we're gonna shake it up. Super frothy. Straight it out because we don't want any of that dead ice uh, in that drink. We're gonna strain it over some fresh ice and the next rock slaps. And then we're gonna put a red wine floater over the top of this cocktail today. I'm using Michael David Petit Petit. After that, we'll throw a nice lemon twist on there and some candy ginger over the top so you know what you're drinking. Now, this cocktail is super unique because we're bringing the cream de violet in it by Rockland and Winter. This is a liqueur that disappeared in the 19, 1900 about and didn't resurface again until 1995 when Rockland and Winter decided to import it from Austria to America. It's a flower that's grown in the high alpines and it's super big over in Europe. And that's kind of where everything started, but it has a really unique, really sweet flavor. It's really hard to mix into cocktails and get right. And that's why it's almost impossible to find in a bar. This drink is gonna have the perfect mix with that and tequila, where you're still gonna have the tequila flavor and it's gonna bring a subtle yet sweet herbal flavor to your mouth that mixes perfectly and it's creamy with the egg white you give your mouth a full creamy mouth feel that's satisfying after a day on the mouth. It's really nice. As well, our ginger and our simple syrup is going to help with the inflammation on the body and eating that candy ginger is going to get more of that in. Ginger is a natural anti-inflammatory so your body is going to feel better when you wake up the next day. You're going to be ready to go rip lines just as hard as you did before that day.